stream Civilization VI, the A to V Deity Challenge. Uh, we Next up on the list is Persia. Persia is one of the spring release leaders. We've played as them once before. Uh, I think we might have tried to pivot to a culture victory after an early war, and that didn't work out for us. Um, so let's talk about our abilities and what we're going to be going for that might be slightly more successful than our last bout. You get two movement. For the, ex for the first 10 turns after declaring a surprise war. That can be really nice if you're trying to snag uh, somebody else's early settler. Um, yeah, pretty much that. I mean, it also helps you assault a city uh, if you need to, if you're just like surrounding a city-state or anything like that. So it's an interesting war uh, mechanic. You're, you're often on deity going to find yourself in an early war. Um, so it, it does wind up being relevant. It's only 10 turns, but sometimes that's enough. Um, satrapies. One trade route capacity with political philosophy and two gold and one culture for routes between your own cities. So that he boosts internal trade routes, which I do like a lot, um, especially when you're founding a new city, helping that new city catch up and particularly giving them some more culture so that their borders expand early is, is quite nice. Um, and your roads are a little bit better. So travel in between your cities is quite good. Uh, Immortal is basically an archer with a better melee strength. They're good. It's a, it's a unique mil military unit. There's nothing, nothing, nothing crazy about any of them across the board, in my opinion. Um, and then he has an, a unique tile improvement, which gives you culture, gold, and appeal. And then tourism. We're not going to go for a tourism-based victory. It's just too hard on Deity. So we're not really going to be utilizing that a lot, um, but these first two might might be relevant. Particularly Satrapies just makes us better. So I'm, I'm going to eye another Domination victory. I know we just did that with Alexander, but hey, there's only four victory types and we're going through every everybody. So it, will, uh, it just has to be what it is. We're going to eye Domination. Space is always a possibility too because we'll just get good science and... Those two are pretty interchangeable, but we just did space, so we'll try for another domination victory. And as always, we're playing on Deity, and I do find myself very much enjoying the balanced start position. So without further ado, we'll listen to the opening, we'll talk about our first couple turns, and then we'll put a cut in here and start the actual first video. From the first stirrings of life beneath water, to the great beasts of the Stone Age. To man taking his first upright steps, you have come far. Now begins your greatest quest, from this early cradle of civilization on towards the stars. Claim the crown, Cyrus, King of Persia, for you are the Anointed One. With immortal soldiers and an unwavering faith, you will conquer and rule the peoples of the world. You may see many alliances forming around you, but do not be fooled. Such is an antiquated and weak way of navigating the world. Make no promise unless it aids you in achieving your goals. Okay, so his, his unique ability is a little bit bugged. Apparently, if we move into the hills or forest or river right away, we'll use all four moves instead of just two. Okay. That's good to know. Thank you. I appreciate that. Any any bug like that? <laughs> this is not a bug-free game, even after six, six months of release. So let's take a look um, at our opening. Clearly not as crazy as our last one. Uh, we have particularly weak luxury in the, the gypsum. Uh, one food, eventually three production tile is not great. And then we have citrus, which is a good food tile to, to start with, but no additional production. We also have another river over here that we could eye. You know, we could certainly move over here. I would never really found on this coast, even though it has the best sort of array. We just like the... Uh, we like the housing capacity of a river city. So I'm tempted to move up here, but the additional hills, let's see, would we ever move over here? Be one, two, three turns until a found. 
Persia is a month old, though, yeah. Um, I think let's go this way and just see what we're in for. Okay. I don't love this start. We do get some luxuries, but in general, we're going to be working pretty weak tiles. If we move here, it's citrus into hopefully we grow into a basic tile. That feels bad. If I move here to three, maybe that's our best path and just go with the unknown. We may just restart this. Don't you get the luxury if you found the city on top of it? I know that that was a Civ Five mechanic. I don't know if that's actually true in this one. We could test it. Yeah, I'm probably going to remake. Let's test your theory if we're, if we're going to remake. Yeah, it's just it's just not good enough. I want to see if we get the I don't think we do. Maybe when we unlock uh mining, we would get it. You can. You read it last night. I I assume we need Yeah, I I'm assuming that we would need the tech to actually get it. Yeah, let's remake though. Even though this isn't awful, founding on top of this, maybe we can live with that then. Can we live with that? It's a pretty, it's a pretty vulnerable capital. We, we moved away from the copper, but we could possibly put a, a tighter city over here. And we did get an extra production because we found it on top of the gypsum. And then we begin with a two food, two production tile, which is fine. And then hopefully we'd grow into that. It's still not very good. It's still not very good. Let's look one more turn. Let's look one more turn, and then we'll decide if we remake. Because I am not in love with it. Yeah. I don't like it. Pretty weak. Pretty weak on deity. Calls for calls for restarting, yeah. I agree. Johnny Boy Jensen. It's a pretty bad, pretty bad start. So let's do that. Go to deity. Start position balanced. And pray. From the first stirrings I of life it, beneath I? water. I think it is. To the great beasts of the Stone Age. To man taking his first upright steps, you have come far. Now begins your greatest quest. From this early cradle <laughs> of civilization on towards the stars. Claim the crown, Cyrus. Oh, son of a biscuit. Well... I believe the rule was I have to play. I only get one reroll. So I think I have to play this. Love to go find those bananas. Seriously, like no river at all. It's pretty it's pretty rude. Are we exploring this 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 was not a great strategy in the uh, Catherine game. Although that's not why we lost. I think we just pray for a river. God. Dang it. It's really, really bad from a defensive standpoint. And it has almost no hills at all. So it is 
Yeah, my luck was drained. Yeah, after the last one. That was a pretty gross opener. And we don't even see a shred of a river. And clearly this continent comes back around. So we're not we can't count on this being coastal. Just remake it and cut it out of the video? No, I, if I remake it again, I'll just remake it again. I'm not going to be dishonest. <laughs> I, don't, I, I refuse to be dishonest. That is one of my major pet peeves. Just live an honest life. So here are our hills. It's so ballsy to... So I can either move back and found next turn, or we can pray for a river. If we pray for a river, we gotta go this way. No, on Deity, we're, we're worried about, uh, about much more than luxuries and resources. As far as resources go, this was fine, because we can grow fast into a production tile, into a production tile, um, but it, there's nothing to help us sustain an early assault. Founding on a city, or founding on a hill is usually really, really good. Um, if we move towards the bananas, it can help make up for a start, and we just pray that there's either coast or, uh, we pray that there's either coast or river. So do we wanna go here and then this way? Or down and then hopefully into something here. I think down. I'm eyeing those bananas. Okay. So. Oh my god. How is there no river? Huh? <gasps> Fuck. Sorry. No! <laughs> I went from so happy to so sad. So happy to so, so sad. <laughs> I was like, double banana and a river. So about that restart. Oh my, terrible. Let's turn three. <laughs> oh my god, worst start of my life. There we go. All right, we found it. <laughs> Feels suicide, man. Ruined by squatters. I, I, we might have to take Hong Kong for that. Just, just punish them for their insolence. Oh, this would have been better. This would have been even better because there's a hill found with bananas. All right, but we're committed to this now. Oh my god, are you kidding? I can't even go here. Oh, what is my life right now? Okay. Well, it's turn six, and we have a city. <laughs> oh, it feels bad, man. All right, let's take a little more vision. Remake. I, I, I feel like 
Is it a challenge if I just get to do whatever I want? Or is, or is the challenge just getting through it? We have decent tiles. We're in between two city-states, so we're going to get culture for border expansion and the production. We've got bananas within reach. I got to play you guys. We're going to we're going to try. We're going to try. All right. Um it's typical slinger start. We get to start with a 3 food and one production into a 2-2, two -two, which is perfectly fine. And then hopefully we'll expand. I know we're going to expand here, but we're going to have to buy bananas at some point. Stuck in the middle between two city-states. Does not feel good. And all this territory really sucks. Can't win if you settle on turn five. I know. I do know this. I do know this. All right, well, in any case, we're going to put a cut in here for a very sad turn one video. Turn one to turn six. 